you just try to see uh, where he's serving in the last moment, you know, because uh, every player has a motion and of the serve, and uh, every player, if you uh, if you watch closely, he has a, a little bit of difference when he serves cross court and down the line. So that's the biggest secret to beat uh, the serving guys. If you can uh, see a little bit earlier where he's serving, and uh, then you have those small. Uh, milliseconds to guess the right way, and uh, that's what I try to do. Oh, hi, Alex. Um, two weeks on clay, the trespassing to to hard courts to prepare both uh, master uh, masters of uh, Indian Wells and Miami. Uh, how your how are your feelings about the surface mm -hmm. and the the transition, of course? Oh, it's, it's great. You know, I'm winning matches, so that's really good. I'm. Uh, I had some clay court matches, which is good for the upcoming uh, summer season on clay. And uh, now I've got some uh, hard court matches here before Indian Wells in Miami, so it couldn't be better. I'll just uh, try to keep on doing my work and uh, keeping healthy and uh, playing some good tennis. That's, I mean, I think for now it's uh, going good. Uh, Alexander. This is your second time here in Acapulco, and you are for second time in a row in semifinals. So it looks like Acapulco goes fine with you. Yeah, for sure. I mean, as you said, I'm second time, and uh, same is for the second time. So uh, for sure, it's a good place for me. Obviously, I'm happy to be here, and uh, even though it's hard court this year, I'm uh, still playing good, which is uh, which is nice, and uh, it's great. I'll be hoping to make a better result this year. Do you have any preference for your next rival in the next round? No, not really. I'm uh, uh, playing two weeks, uh, you know, a lot of matches, and uh, now I'm just trying to keep uh, myself ready and uh, fit for for the match. I mean, that's that's the main thing now. I, I wouldn't look for someone uh, for some opponent to win or, or lose. So we'll see how it goes. I'll just try to do my best. Uh I'd like to ask you about the preseason. Did you, because you know the calendar is so, so uh, incredible. It's you have a lot of tournaments. Uh, did you, did you prepare? Did you have a, a preseason time on like, like December or, or something? Yeah, this year I, I had one month, one full month of preseason, and uh, actually the week before the preseason I already started doing some work physically. So. I had a long and uh, quite good preseason, you know, because uh, once you were top 20 and uh, you go out with the ranking, you're not too happy. So, I mean, it, it makes uh, you get uh, extra motivation to work. So, for sure, I worked uh, better than the year before. I didn't play any exhibitions, I didn't do anything, and uh, had a good preparation in Dubai. So, I'm happy with that. Alexander, it's been nearly two years since you make uh, semifinals back to back in back to back tournaments. Can you talk about that and what has changed for you to reach uh, the two straight semifinals? Oh, first of all, I've uh, I've got more mature. You know, I'm uh, I'm older, and uh, I, I guess I have played more tennis. You know, I know how to do it better now, and uh, also, as I said, I had a good preparation, so physically that's easier to do. Uh, to travel and then play a match, it's a, a little bit easier than when you're not that fit. So that's, I think, the main points. Uh, one, one more. Uh, I think this, is, in my opinion, is like this is pretty early to to be speaking about you or asking about you about you for this. Uh, are you aware that this tennis league on Asia that is like uh, setting up? Uh, do you, are you aware of this? Uh, do you plan to? It, it's like a tennis league on several countries on Asia. Uh, are you are you preparing for this league? Do you want to play the? Uh, I don't know yet. Uh, I'm aware of it happening. I've talked to my manager, but I didn't have the time to speak to my team yet. And uh, are we going to plan that, or are we going to make a long preparation as this year? It, it depends. Uh, I mean, I think it's a good thing, so you can pick if you want to play or not. So, obviously, it's good for the players who who have a choice uh, to play some matches, to make some extra money. It's uh, it's great, but uh, I'm not sure what I'll be willing to do yet.